Here's a quick look at some of the stocks we're watching for you this Friday, September 23rd. Keep an eye on shares of Twitter today. They continue to move lower this morning after RBC Capital essentially downgraded the stock to a sell on worries about ad revenue. RBC says it polled more than 1,000 people in the advertising industry for their feelings about online advertising and specifically Twitter. The microblogging site earned poor marks. Analysts at RBC had been neutral on Twitter's shares. They cut their price target to $14 from $17. Facebook shares are also lower this morning. The social networking giant was found to have overestimated a key video metric for two years. The Wall Street Journal says the tech giant vastly overestimated the average viewing time for video ads, sometimes by 60 to 80 percent, something that's making big ad buyers and marketers very upset. Facebook says the error has been corrected, but it's an embarrassment for the company, which has been touting record growth in video consumption. Moving to the upside this morning are shares of the finish line. The sporting goods retailer posted stronger than expected sales for its latest quarter. Finish line said it earned 53 cents a share in line with estimates. But on the top line, sales rose to roughly $509 million. That was about $15 million higher than what had been expected. Same store sales rose 5.1 percent. That was nearly double what had been forecast. The finish line also raising annual guidance for both same-store sales and earnings. Shares of the finish line are up 33 percent so far this year. And there could be more trouble for Samsung. South Korea's YTN News Network is reporting incidents of newly exchanged smartphones overheating or losing battery power even as they are being charged. So far, the complaints have been only in South Korea. For the latest headlines from the world of business, check back on thestreet.com throughout the day. I'm Ruben Ramirez on Wall Street.